Well, I guess while you were locked up, white boy Rick started actually messing with your wife. Right. Uh, Kathy. Uh, Absolutely. When you found out about that, how'd you feel? No different. The only thing I was really concerned about is me doing this time up in jail. What goes on out in the street you can't worry about. You can't deal with what's going on out there. You got to live your life. You got to come in. You sit up in jail or anywhere you at and be worried about what's going on in the street. You're going to be stressed out and you're going to start having mental problems. So that wasn't a big issue to me about who she was dating. Plus, she was at the time she was getting high and not trying to make no excuses here, but she was getting high. So just like I told them at the mom museum, they went up to the, the uh, she had, they had put her in rehab. They went up to the rehab place and got her, made her deals, offered her drugs and this and that. So quite naturally, if you're a dope, I hate to say it like that, but if you're using drugs, let's put it like that. If you use a drug, you might accept and say anything. You might be telling a lie. You could be telling anything. With you accepting drugs, who's to say you're telling the truth about anything? So, I mean, what, what was it to be mad about then? I was concerned about my time. I wasn't concerned about what my wife was doing. That's life. Life Fair goes enough. on. Okay, so you get busted, you know, you go through the whole uh, process, you accept your 20 years, and then later that year, white boy Rick gets busted as well. Right. And you would think with all the cooperation that he did that they would just let it all slide, but in fact, he ends up getting life in prison. Right. It's like, let's go back to this here then, though. I mean, did nobody, just like right now, Say for hypothetically speaking, I go to Cardone, anybody and put a gun in, in their hand and say, man, go kill this. That's Cardone's decision to make. So they did, I didn't make Cardone do anything. You have your own life to live. So he, if he decides that's what he want to do, that's on him. So if the feds came to him and he made that decision that he wanted to help his family out or get the time off his father or whoever it was, his sister, mother, whoever it was, then he did what he chose to do. Johnny Dunn what he chose to do, but I accepted mine and went and dealt with it. I didn't go back and decide to tell on nobody or snitch out nobody. I chose that game. I have to deal with it. Anybody else should. They choose that game. You live with the consequences. Simple. 